Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, Plenty Princess 92 My name is Ashley. Today I wanted to do a one month growth update on what this Spider Farmer SF300 LED full spectrum grow light has done for my plants. In as little as one month, it really has done a sufficient amount of growth for my plants. My plants have really grown quite a lot for one month under this light and I'm really pleased with how bright this light is and how much it really has contributed to the growth of my plants. As you can see it illuminating over all of my plants behind me. It's very bright. It covers a very wide variety of this shelf behind me without any of the plants getting less light. All the plants get an equal amount of bright light which is one factor that I really love most about this light. I'm going to highlight three plants today that I've seen the biggest difference in, and the first one is going to be my African Violet. As you see here, there's already not much to it, but the picture I'm going to show you before, there's a lot of new growth down here. We were missing all of this in here. So in one month, that is a lot of leaves that have grown on this plant. Um, this plant is kind of like a medium grower. So it kind of just kept growing, but kept growing very slowly. And ever since I installed this light and had this plant placed under the light, it kind of really just got a little growth spurt and popped out these little this little patch of leaves right there in the center, which is really awesome because before that, obviously, this plant was very bare. It had nothing to it. And now it's kind of starting to fill out and come across the whole pot, which is nice. The second plant I'm going to highlight is these cuttings of my jade pothos. Before placing them under this light, they didn't have any roots. They were taking a while to root for some reason, which is kind of weird because pothos really root so easily, so readily. Maybe because it's winter and through winter time, especially with the less light, the really dry spell that we get with no humidity, really low humidity, they were taking such a long time to root. I think the light, the brightness from the light really did push this along. Now they have tons of little roots poking out and you can kind of see that each and every one of these have a nice amount of roots starting on each stem which again is really great because they were just, they were just not taking. I thought I was gonna have like a big bunch of cuttings that I wasn't going to be able to use. Last but not least, this is the plant that has really grown the most of this light. Before this plant was very sparse, this is my philodendron Brazil. This plant was very sparse. There was hardly anything in this plant, a couple stems and that was it and each of those stems didn't really have much growth on it. Now this plant has so much new growth, so much growth coming out of those stems, and it really just filled the pot. Also, there's a lot of really nice coloration in the leaves itself. It kind of has like a little pink tint to it, and it really does look gorgeous. I'm loving the way this plant has filled out and the coloration that the leaves have got from being under this awesome grow light. I definitely would recommend this grow light. If you saw the installation video, if you didn't, I will link it up at the top for you guys. But if you saw it, you saw how easy it was to install. You see how bright the light is. I gave you a little background information on this light, the spectrums of the light. You have the warm white, the blue, the red, and you even have that IR lighting, which is not in a lot of other lights. It's full spectrum, they're LED chips, which is a very great aspect of a grow light and is definitely what you want when you are looking for a grow light. And it's a sleek design, it's very thin, it's very slim and it's very lightweight. It's perfect for small spaces and it's not harsh on the eye. As you see, I have this placed in my living room so aesthetically it looks nice as well. I really do love this grow light and I highly, highly recommend it, especially for the quality and the price of the grow light. If you're looking for something small and compact, that gives a big punch to your plants. Thank you guys again for joining me in another video. I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about this light and seeing the growth updates of my plants under this light. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're interested in the content I provide. And as always, every plant's a princess. Bye.